Well, morning guys. Just getting ready to go off on our summer tour. Our fourth slash five days. It's only four for me, five for the others. Um, summer tour of the Cornish Cornwall Tour 2021. Uh, weather's not looking great. We are expecting rain, but hey ho. So without further ado, it's going to take me about two, about two, two and a quarter hours to meet up with the boys, depending on the traffic. Then we're going to go and have some breakfast, and then head on down to the campsite in Tiverton, in Devon. Um, I don't know why we call it the Cornwall tour. Well, we are touring Cornwall even though we're going to be based in Devon, Tiverton. <clears throat> so, I suppose without further ado, just going to go and get the bike on. Just about ready to go and drink my tea. Be setting off about another 10 minutes. So, the next time you see me, I'll be with the boys. Hopefully, fingers crossed, all being good. And fingers crossed, we won't have none of that wet stuff. It'll still be dry. So, wish me luck. Um, love you all. See you all a bit later on. Until then, bye. -bye. All all right. Oh, here we go, Rasta. Oh, 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 yes. Morning, YouTube. We're off on our self tour. Me and Iceman going to meet the others up. So yes, we're off to Devon. Tiverton. Weather forecast not great, but one thing you can't guarantee is the weather. <coughs> and also, I dropped a right ghoulie. Let's see how my bike performs on E10 fuel because I didn't mean to, but I changed the pumps over at the garage. Where I go, same pump. I looked, filled it up. I got E10 fuel. So let's see how this baby performs on my me. Here we go. Let's do it, bro. Right, folks. Here we go. The day is here. The start of the Motorev South Coast Tour. The weather forecast is crap. So, got waterproofs on, just be open. So it's not quite as bad as they're predicting. Anyway, it is what it is. I'm gonna go now and meet up with the rest of the lads. The Hagley Road, before we get onto the M5 to go down to meet Albury. So, hopefully all will be good. It's quite bright at the minute, actually. So. If this would continue, well, uh, not likely. Well, here we are. Our summer tour, South West Coast tour. We're just setting off, so we're just going to go meet the other boys. We've had a few drop out at the last minute. So we are three men down. We didn't lose Nathan at the last minute. We knew about Nathan. He's a... Um, him and his uh, good wife are having a baby, so that decision was made earlier. But we lost Escobar and Viper last night. So here we go, on our way. So I think we were expecting some heavy rain today on the motorway. And gutted, yes, we are gutted, because today we should have been heading to the south of France. We were going to continue our World War II memorial tour. 
and go and see Ovador Seglane, but due to COVID, it didn't work, so we cancelled it. So we decided to do South Coast of England tour. And we've had absolutely scorching weather up until yesterday, 32 degrees. We're going on tour today. I think it's torrential rain and thunderstorms. So I suppose we'll see how this tour goes. So I think for this year we just made, we're making the best of a bad year. So we're stuck to the UK and hopefully we have a good time. You're going to put fuel in Matt. Plaka. You're going to fill up now or? You're going to fuel up? <laughs> You're going to fuel up now? Yeah, you might as well leave it down if you want, because I had to fill up, a, when I eat about 120 on that, I like to fill up. Yes. Yeah. Oh, I'll fill up then, then. Yeah, Victor. Here comes Ali Steelhorse. Vic is in the house. It's all loaded up for a fortnight. I'm going to five weeks. Huh? I'm going to five weeks. I think it looks like you know. It's quite low, eh, Dad? Nice and low, eh? These two, the short arse. Vic is in the house. It does look really loud, that does, Vic. It does look loud. Is that the weight? It's low anyway, but it's a bit lower than normal. Oh, no, no. It was loud when you asked us to out there, it was nice and loud for you. Open for me. Oh no, yeah. Perfect for Vic. And the yeah. handlebars and like nice and bingo up there. Nice yeah, we've got that way a bit Vic. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The height difference. The bike. Oh, GL. I know. I'll be dangling in the air or that. So it looks like we've got no bear. So here we are, ready, ready to go on tour, we've got the boys. We're Moynus Bear, we're Moynus Viper and we're Moynus Escobar. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine and then we're going to meet Albie at Bristol Services so there'll be ten of us. 
So we won up from last year. Let's have a look at Piggy's hands. Let's have a look at your hands, Piggy. Just scabbing up now. It's normally there, when it where you get it. Where the skin creases. To be honest, we've been putting the cream on and they've been sweet as a nut. It's only because I've not put them on this morning, it's all. And you might you might just get this rubbing out in you a bit. Just let the creases into it. Me and the pig star. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I'd make a little basket clamp on here and have a tinny in it, you know. Yeah. Me and Gordon will have a couple of Guinnesses each. By the way, horses are banned from this trip, I've told Piggy. <laughs> sheep are the in thing. Uh, sheep, sheep are the future. Horses are so yesterday. <laughs> Watch the pecking order there. So that's it. We've cleared Bristol. We are just going to meet Alby. And I'll tell you what, we're going to go around all this traffic. We're going to go around it, blood, and try and uh, make marina. So we've had a nice little cruise down. We've had a few little spits of rain. Nothing major. Breeze in there, crackhead, where he's going. Whoa! Oh my god, blood. Let's do it, man. Yeah. Yeah, I mean. That's it. Put them all folding. So, I mean, what do you want to do, guys? Bear was on about stopping at a calf further down, or do you want to get something to eat here instead? Yeah. I think it was about another 20 minutes from here. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Feel in it. Any blood. Go. Oh, I can smell cannabis. What do you say? Stay in the right lane. Yeah. In the right lane. Where am I going? Oh, yeah. So where am I going? I just follow it round. No, I think that, that's... What? Is it? Or is that just fuel? No. This is not right. Yeah, well, I, unless Albie's there at the fuel. Let's find out. Let's have a look. Just pull up here and then... Yeah. Pull up here then we can, for those, those those who want fuel. I need fuel anyway, Crackademus. So I'll go and fuel up now. Yeah, you might as well. Yeah, I'll go and fuel up. Yeah. <coughs> I'll tell you what, I'm going to go around and find Albie. Yeah. I think he's back in, in the services bit. So we need to try and, oh, okay, now we're going to do this. We need to try and turn around on this car park, don't we? Where is he? Well, that's Albie's at the fuel station. I don't know. Yeah. Oh, there he is! Petrol station! Getting fuel! Oh. 
Okay, boys. Have you hit any rain yet? <laughs> hey. Have you hit any rain yet? We've had a few little spots, that's yeah, it. That's We're coming round now. No. No, nothing that says there's a car for about 20 minutes to do. I don't know. It's hit and miss, I eat. Very rare you'll get down here without anything. Well, anywhere from that, what's that retail map? That's 16. Anything from there. I've oh, done Western last week, or... Uh. Are you the crackers on? Let's slap them. Keep that on, that I will be coming on his new bike. Oh, it's nice, eh? What is it? The pan? I've got the gold in. Nice, eh? Nice. Nice, is it? Very nice. It's a beast, eh? Oh, what like cleaning it? Yeah. Oh, DCT, 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 that is, a, that is a fair weapon, isn't it? Beast, are you? Driving a car on two wheels. Oh, yeah, We've all got a second turn in the morning. DCT as well, What's that? I don't even understand how that works. Nice, eh? So there we go. We got Albie on his new bike. So we're just gonna head off. We're gonna go off head to the cafe now. Go get some dinner. What's that say? Closed of a Saturday. <laughs> go over here the corner out the way. I can help you, what are you doing? Oh. There we go. Dinner stop for the boys. Turning right, next right, next right, Rastado.
turning left. Car come in! Car come in! Slow down, blood! Back her down. <clears throat> Left at the end of the road. Bad junction, that is, you can't see. You clear? Clear. Yeah, clear. Still clear. Okay. Car coming. Bike down, bike down. What? Who's down? Oh, Christ. Hope he's all right. <coughs> uh, as long as he. What, mate? I don't know damage anyway, has he? I don't Can know. Do we hear anything from him? Not yet, no. Here comes somebody, is it Goose, is it? Yeah. Yeah, he's alright. Yeah, is he alright? Yeah, yeah, he's just getting back on it now. Like what happens? You know, when you go around the bend there, that camber? Yeah. I think his foot... He day like sort of put his... Oh, I don't think, you know. I think something to do with his foot slipped, I think. I'm just checking, because my... My bag's right. Oh, move forward a bit. It's easily done, isn't it? We've all done it. Oh, sunshine! Come on! Sunshine! That's <laughs> better. Well, it was forecast, wasn't it? Uh, Escobar will be kicking himself. Yeah. I was surprised when he said that yesterday. After, after the grey golf. After the golf. Completely clear left, mate. Still clear. Still clear, boys. Clear, clear, it's on the rear. That is your motorway miles done for the day. Yay. To be honest with you, it does feel a bit squishy. You can borrow my pump if you're nice to me. Well, I'll pull, pull in here at the parking, because it does, it does feel a bit squishy. Yeah, that, 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 that is low, isn't it? Oh, 
Good job we got the... Yeah. Looks like he's going to have to. I thought when I was wrong, I thought, you know, sometimes you got the ridges in the road. Find the nail now. Right, let's get, let's get it on the centre stand. Yeah, shredding up. Yeah, shredding it, isn't it? You got one on you. I've got a pump, yeah. Well, here we go, the boys to the rescue. So, coming down here, this dual carriageway for about the last 10 miles, the bike felt a bit squishy. And it was, I could feel it move, at least I was thinking it was just the wind. One tall piggy was behind me, and he says, your back tyre looks a bit flat. So we've just found out there was a massive nail in the back of the tyre. So we've just done a punch repair. Vic's using his, his present he had, which is a little uh, air compressor. Looks absolutely brilliant, that does. He's blowing up the tyre. So as you can see, my tyre was that flat. <laughs> I've been shredding rubber. So, I don't know if you can see it. There's the puncture repair. So hopefully, that lasts. And we're only eight miles from the campsite. Right, I don't. Motorway needs my assistance. Well, there we go. Punch repair is done. We will now see if it holds up. Say it, put that on. Say it again. Hold on. Say it again. I said, if you laugh at me trying to get my tent up now, I'm putting a nail in that <laughs> uh, Goose. Goose. I would like to put to the board that I think Vic should have all of his written warnings withdrawn for that. Okay, fresh slate today. I think he should start from a fresh slate. I'd settle for a Wade, tin of Guinness. I think Wade should um, have one though, because he says he wanted to carry on with barrels. A bang out of order, mate. Piggy, your job for the next eight miles is to watch my back tyre. <laughs> but let's try and do this eight miles again. Well that, well, that feels better already. <laughs> and here we are, we are arriving at the campsite. Zecum Farmhouse. This is going to be our digs for the next five nights. Car, come in. Car, car. So where do we... Ooh. Reception left. Ah. We're looking all right. Yeah. Good. Good job, Vic. Yeah, some big tents on here, aren't they? Well, that's a shame. <laughs> Hello. Yeah, Thank you ever way. so much that's for looking after us. All right, see you in a bit.
yeah, we've got all this. Men are here making fire. When I was in the SAS, I'm, I'm oh, oh, that's on fire. Yeah, that is. You want to like, you want to get down here, don't you? No, give me that one. Some more paper, quick, quick, get, the get it underneath now. That's it, right at the bottom. Look at he's done it. Oh, he's done it. That's the Olympic torch. Right, can you carry it round the campsite? <laughs> you watch them that many embers coming off that tonight. Roy's tend to be like a tea bag in the morning. <laughs> it was raining and I was warm and wet. <laughs> it tends like a kid. It tends like a colander. So here we are on tour yes. with our glow sticks. <laughs> <laughs> All thanks to Wade. He's only 63 years old. He's, 63. he's, he's bought 100 of them. <laughs> <laughs> he bought them off Amazon for 69.99. <laughs> They're more like a bunch of kids. They're more playing Star Wars. <laughs> Wade, how old are you? You've got one in your hand. You've all got goose. Yep, you've all got goose. I'll bring you the things that would make them into glasses if you wanted to expand them. Complete set. It'll make them into wristbands tomorrow. I think we should put them through our spokes on our wheels. <laughs> First day done, we've got here fine. Uh, what a journey down we had though. We set off about half past nine. Predicted bad weather and storms all the way down. We had none. We didn't have any rain. The only thing we noticed when we got to Bristol, the roads were wet, so obviously at some point it rained early in Bristol, but we didn't get to see it. But from junction 14 down to about junction 26, it was just solid traffic on the motorway. Uh, luckily enough, we managed to filter up all the way, which I imagine you've probably just seen some of that footage of us filtering. So we did good, uh, all nine of us filtering. Not one of us smacked a wind mirror and we we're probably doing a good a good 50 miles of filtering. We did a lot of filtering today, but we did good. A couple of little mishaps. Uh, Matt dropped his bike. A uh, bit of a funny road with a little drop verge at the edge. Um, I nearly went down it myself when a car came down. Um, Matt put his foot down, missed and went over, but you know, nothing major. Looking off his crash bars, saved the bike. And then later on, as you've all probably seen, you've probably just seen all this, I got a puncher. So, 
Punch is repaired. We've checked the tyre pressure. It's fine at the moment. We'll check it again in the morning, see if it's okay. But all should be good. So I'm in bed now. I'm in the big tent. I'm all tucked up. I could hear somebody snoring already. So we've had a good night. Ordered in some pizzas. Had a fire pit. Had a few drinks. But this campsite, Zecum Farm House, they're absolutely brilliant. The owners of the site, they can't do enough for you. You know, they loaned us extra electric hookup leads. They loaned us the fire pit. They even brought over a little cool box for us to keep our beers in. They've been absolutely brilliant. I've never known a campsite like this. You know, most campsites are quite the opposite. They either tell you to shut up or, you know, they don't offer a lot of assistance, but this was absolutely brilliant. Zecum Farmhouse, I'll put a link up to it. You know, if anyone's down this area, Devon, Cornwall, to a, you know, Somersetish way, if you want somewhere to come and camp, they're welcome bikers. Zecum Farmhouse, absolutely fantastic. They've got a little shop on site, but it's absolutely brilliant. They sell everything in the shop. They've got two fridges, so if you buy some beers, you can keep your beers in the fridge. Or they'll bring over this call box for you. Now they've been absolutely brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. So the weather's been absolutely stunning as well. We've got in here at the campsite. Brilliant sun all afternoon. So tomorrow's looking the same. So what we're going to do, we're going to play it easy. We've got no set plans to do tomorrow. So what we're going to do, we're going to get up in the morning, sort some breakfast out of them. We'll just look on the weather app find out what's going to be the best place with the sun and we'll head over there and have another great day so everything's uncharged we'll see you in the morning Oosh.